Hello everyone and welcome back to The Forge. For this week's project I'm going to take this old railroad spike here and an old circular saw blade and we're going to forge out a miniature garden hoe. So let's go ahead and get this tossed in the forge and let's get to work.
All right, here's where we are so far. We've got the handle and everything in the shaft of our mini hoe forged out. I'm going to go into the grinder now. I'm going to grind the stob here on the end that we'll paint over when we put the blade on. So let's go ahead and get in there and get that taken care of. All right, what I'm doing here is there's nothing special to it. I'm just going to come in here with a piece of soap stone. You can use a sharpie or whatever else you want. I'm just going to mark all the way around this, kind of eyeball it to see where I want my shoulders to end. That, the part that will butt up to the blade of the hoe. And so just a quick mark around it. We'll grind it down to a little stub and then we'll be ready to heat it up. And then we'll be ready to cut out our blade, heat it up, and paint it over. So let's get it ground to shape. Here's the saw blade we're going to use. It's just an old wore out circular saw. Plenty thick enough to make a hoe blade out of. So this is one that I've made in the past and we're just going to use the front of this one here, the blade portion of this as our template on here. So I'm just going to find somewhere to stick it. Right there looks good. Now for those of you that might be wondering, uh, I'll put in the description I'll put the measurements of the blade that I cut out, but I mean the blade looks to be in the ballpark of about four inches wide and has an overall height of four inches. So just a four inch by four inch square and then you can kind of draw however you want the blade to look like I did little notches on this one here at the top, but pretty straightforward. It'll work out. My wife used this one in the, in the garden all spring. And so this one actually should be a little bit more comfortable on the hand because it's longer. So we'll see how it works out. For now, let's get this cut out. All right, and there's our mini railroad spike garden hoe made from an old railroad spike and a circular saw. Didn't turn out half bad. Makes an excellent little weekend project to get out in the forge and knock out. And with that being said, I appreciate you for joining me today. If you wouldn't, that subscribe button down below. Ring the notification bell as well. Notified of our newest content when it posts. I appreciate you very much for watching. You have a good one. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.